Hey there, I'm CBS4 meteorologist Ashton Altieri. We're getting lots of questions about the Rocks Home Opener on Friday. So let's get into this. Let's talk about the big changes we're going to experience here in Colorado as uh, we get into opening day. Here's the situation around the country. First, the cold front out here on the East Coast. You know, everything with weather is always connected. This is going toward the East Coast. This is the front that moved through Colorado back on Monday night, bringing us the chilly day we had here yesterday. Notice the tail end of this front is over here in western Kansas and western Nebraska, not far to our east. As we go through time, the front stays to the east of us today, tonight, and tomorrow. And then on Friday, it backs west right up along the front range. And this situation is going to produce upslope here along the I-25 corridor, which is going to mean a cloudy and wet Friday for us. Looks like it's going to be rain to start and then it'll change into some snow Friday afternoon. Look at these temperatures on Friday. We'll be lucky, lucky to reach into the lower 40s here in the Denver area Friday afternoon. So for the game, first pitch temperature 41 degrees and then the temperatures will drop by the ninth inning, mid to upper 30s. Again, cloudy and cold with rain in the morning, changing to snow in the afternoon. There's been some questions about postponement with this game. Our understanding is that if there's no lightning, which there won't be, and there's no heavy rain, which there shouldn't be, the game will most likely go on. Now, I guess they can always change from their rules, but that's what we've heard so far. These are the coldest uh, home openers in Rockies franchise history. Uh, of course, the franchise started in 93, two years later. First game at Coors Field, uh, April 95. Look at that, it was 40 degrees, and that is the record for the coldest home opener. So we will come close to challenging that record on Friday, assuming the game is played as scheduled. So if you are heading out there, just be prepared for the chilly, wet weather. We'll keep you posted right here on CBS4.